You find out you need Pierce to stabilize your foundation. Now you must find which solution is better. Stay tuned as Push Pierce and Helical Pierce go head to head to find out which is best. Hi, I'm Nolan Beery, the Director of Sales Development at AccuLevel. When it comes to installing piers, you have two choices. In this video, I'll explain what push piers are and what helical piers are, and which one is best. If you're a homeowner and you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, ring that bell for more content about home foundation repair and waterproofing. Let's get started. A push pier is a steel pipe that's just smooth that uses your home or your structure as a counterweight to push the pier into the ground until the structure lifts or will no longer push the pier into the ground. So think of it a lot like you taking a piece of rebar into your yard and pushing it into the ground until your feet come off the ground. A helical pier is going to be more like the screw-like option. If we think of push piers as a nail, the helical pier is the screw version of that. So it's going to independently screw into the soil until we get the capacities that we're looking for, then attach to your home's foundation and attempt to lift. This is going to have, give the installer a lot more control on what type of soil that helical pier is in and is it going to last for a long time. This is not just a clear cut winner, but it depends on the soils in your location as well as the structure you're trying to put piers on. Here in the Midwest, we believe in helicals over push piers. We tend to see layers of soil. We don't just see a soft sand to a very hard clay. We see layers of clay or different types of soils that we wanna be sure that we get all the way down to the good hard soil. In the Midwest, helicals give you those options. A push pier can be a little bit confusing when it hits a hard layer and it may no longer be able to push through that thin good layer to get to the better layer below it. So you lose control with push piers. It also determines the structure on which is best. If you have a bigger structure such as an apartment complex or a high rise, push piers might be a good option. However, if you have a double story or a single story home, or a garage or front porch, for example, that's not gonna be a big enough counterweight to get push piers to the soil that you need it to last forever. And that's where helical piers are the best solution here in the Midwest for homeowners and a lot of residential applications. To schedule an appointment with one of our project advisors, give us a call or go to our homepage, aculevel.com, and click the book a consultation button. Fill out the form and we'll contact you within the next business day. Do you have questions about push piers versus helical piers? If so, please leave them in the comments below. Check out the description for more videos and blog articles on crawl space and foundation repair. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up and ring that bell. We greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.